Hey everyone, today I'm going to be showing you the Elements tool on GoodNotes. I'm going to show you how to use it, how to upload stickers to it, plus a couple of other fun ways that you guys can use this tool. I am obsessed with Elements. This tool really changes the game for stickers, and I know you guys are going to love it, so let's just jump right into it. All right, so whenever you open up GoodNotes, you will see the Elements tool right here. It just has a little star on it. And when you tap it anywhere on your screen, you have all of these presets that are already in GoodNotes, all different kinds of designs. So how to add your own is you're gonna hit the plus button. So you're just gonna hit the plus button and you can add in a new collection. So I'm gonna title my collection Everyday Stickers and this sticker pack is launching on Friday, March 11th if you are interested in any of the stickers that I'm going to show you in this video. So now you have your collection and your collection name. So I'm gonna show you two different ways to add in stickers into your new collection. So for option number one, all you'll do is click import from and then here you'll just, it'll automatically pop up your files app and you'll just locate wherever you saved your stickers. I always like to save them on my desktop. I just find it's very easy to find. And you will just go in here, you'll see there's dark and light stickers. And then there's also full sheets for those of you who maybe don't have good notes or you're using a different app that doesn't have this feature. But for those of you guys who do have good notes, which is while you're watching this video, you can just hit stickers. And once you locate your stickers, you can see that there's 54 stickers here. All you have to do is tap it and it will add it right in there. And the reason why this way takes a longer time is because you have to individually add in each of these different stickers. It's the same step over and over again, but it is pretty long and tedious. So the second way I'm gonna show you is a little bit of a hack for you guys. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go and you're gonna find your stickers in your files app. So you can see we have all of our stickers here. I'm just in the files app and I'm going to grab the select tool. I'm just gonna hit select and I'm just going to quickly bulk select all these. You can just swipe down on your screen to make it really fast and grab all 54 of these stickers and you are going to at the bottom hit the share button and you are then going to hit save 54 images and this will save this to your photos app which we aren't going to keep it on all 54 of these pngs on your photos app forever it's just to quickly import these so once you're back in good notes just open back up that elements tool hit plus title your new collection. I'm titling mine Everyday Stickers. And then instead of hitting import from your files app, you're gonna import from photos. And why this is faster is because you can bulk select in the photos app. I don't know why you can't bulk select for the files. It's just in the photos app. So that's why I like to do it this way because then I don't have to sit there and individually upload each of them. And it's just super easy and it will just be creating the collection. While that's loading, I'm just gonna come back in and I'm going to delete all of these from my photos because I don't need these in my camera roll. All right, so now we're back in GoodNotes. I can just go into my Elements tool and you can see all of my stickers are in here. And all you have to do is just tap on any of the stickers. So I have a meeting at one o'clock. I can just grab the meeting put it in that little spot there, boom. And if you wanna add something to the same collection, all you have to do is just tap into it and you can just, again, add for, add, photos in the same way we did through importing through files or through photos. You can also use multitasking with the elements tool by just clicking this button in the top right hand corner and you can see your full collection of stickers right side by side next to your planner. Another awesome thing you can do with the elements tool is if you wrote something out that you really like the way it looks and you want to save it as a sticker, you can with the elements tool. So you just can grab your lasso tool, tap it, hit add element. I'm going to add a new collection. You can just title this, whatever you want to call it. I'll say scribble, whatever. And you can just do that. So if you ever, you know, create some sort of whether it's text or a graphic on here that you really like and you want to save, you can go ahead and do that. 
Another fun thing you can do is go to Pinterest and you can save a bunch of different quotes from Pinterest by just hitting the three dots at the top right hand corner and downloading it and you can just save a bunch of different cute quotes that you can use in your planner. Add in a title for your collection and hit add photos. Grab all of your Pinterest quotes and they will just import right into your GoodNotes and you will just hit create. And now you have all these cute Pinterest quotes right in your GoodNotes forever. You can just keep using them. And this is great just to quickly add a little bit of something to your planner spreads. All right, so there is your quick overview of the Elements tool in GoodNotes. This is such an awesome tool. Like I said, it changes the game for stickers because once you upload them, you have them in your Elements tool in GoodNotes forever. So it just makes it so easy and super convenient. And I just wanted to show you guys this because it is saving me so much time. Um, but let me know if you guys like these more casual tutorials, just quickly sitting down and showing you guys whether it's a tool on GoodNotes or some sort of iPad hack, let me know. If you want to shop these stickers, they are launching on Friday, March 11th, along with the weekly dashboard. So definitely keep a lookout for that. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.